It's been just over two years since the sudden and dramatic closure of Concordia University. Since then, the campus has sat dormant while some legal drama played out involving the Lutheran Church's handling of the shutdown. Now a sale pending and new life. This campus will become the University of Oregon's Balmer Institute for Children's Behavioral Health, thanks to a huge donation from former Microsoft executive Steve Ballmer and wife Connie. $425 million, it's, uh, take your breath away. This campus will be an education center to train mental health professionals focused on children. We're very excited, obviously, to have this investment in our, our neighborhood and to have the stewardship of U of O of this property. Concordia Neighborhood Association Chair Peter Keller is happy with what's happening. Education for a good cause coming back to this beautiful Northeast Portland campus. Neighbors had concerns it might not go this way. I'm surprised that it turned out this good. Yeah. I thought, you know, there were lots of rumors about crazy stuff happening. Yeah. And then the worst possible would have been if they, like, decided to tear it down and put it in a Walmart. The U of O Concordia deal is pending approval by the school's board of trustees this month. Then the plan is to not only set up the Balmer Institute here, but to eventually move other classes from the university's current downtown home at the White Stag Building. Uh, Keller is in favor of all of it. You know, a, a huge investment and um, a, um, you know, a bright future for our neighborhood. And I just think of all the great energy it's going to bring with these young educators and um, students. And bonus, Keller's been told the large playing fields will remain as an asset for the community. Tim Gordon, KGW News.